good morning, afternoon, night, wherever you are. It is morning for me and it's a beautiful day. I feel the luck in the air and we're gonna go thrifting. I wanna look for clothing and I also wanna look for some supplies for a little project that I have going on in my head. Right now I'm making a rug, I'm making a lamp and now I'm like, I wanna make a pillow. I wanna, I wanna like custom make so a pillow but obviously we're gonna look for clothes too when i get dressed for going to the thrift store i have a very specific uniform that i have to wear pretty much i like to wear really tight clothing so that i can slip on and off my pieces that i find um a lot of thrift stores don't have dressing rooms so that is essential so I have these pants that I'm gonna wear and finding underwear I can wear with these it can be hard because of how tight they are and I don't like showing a panty line so I have these underwear that are the universal seamless by parade who is also the sponsor for this video. I've worked with Parade a handful of times and I love their underwears and bras. I'm actually wearing a set right now, which I'll show you. Guys, this is literally my everyday. It's so stretchy, it's so silky. Clearly you can tell that I love this color. This is their Poseidon color and I can literally own every piece that they sell. Typically when I wear super tight pants, like I am forced to wear a thong, but with their universal seamless underwear, it is just as good, just as invisible. And overall, I just feel more comfortable, more confident like being out in public with these on. I have this shirt and since it's such a low scoop neckline, a regular bra would show like on the sides. So I'm gonna wear it with this bralette and honestly I wear bralettes more than I wear regular bras. It's just always been more comfortable to me but it's imperative that I find a bralette that is still supportive at the same time and why I love this bralette is because it actually accommodates my bust to band ratio whereas like you know growing up there wasn't really an option for that it was always a very relative like extra small to extra large and even the extra large cup size might not even be big enough for me it was always just such a vague sizing but this is actually parade's extended sh sizing and you can see just how well it fits me because the band isn't all the way up my back, if you know what I mean. This is their cotton, which was the same as the boxers, and they are made with 95% less water than traditional cotton is made with. It's like this shirt has a built-in bra. The straps are wide enough also so that like I have this full exposure here. I need my Crocs because I also need to be able to slip on and off my shoes to try on other shoes. And this is the fit. Like, I'm not really trying to make a statement. I'm just trying to be my most effective thrifter trier honor today. I'm going to freshen up a little bit more, but first I want to thank Parade for sponsoring this video. And I encourage you guys to try their underwears and their bralettes using my unique link and discount code, which is alivera-bf. The link is in the description box below and it's an extension to their Black Friday sale but even their Black Friday sale wasn't as good as this discount is. You get 50% off. It is totally exclusive to you guys so this is your chance to stock up especially if you're a busty girl like me. Okay one thing that I know that I want to find is an oversized cardigan. This is too oversized. In fact this is king size. Uh, I like an oversized sweater. If I could just find one that was like four bucks, that'd be more worth it. I like the material of this. Okay, so one thing for sure is like material is so essential for me. If I don't like the way it feels, I'm not going to get it. Like I can feel the quality of a piece. And this is nice. This must be wool. Yeah, it's lamb's wool. It's not the right fit though. I'm not gonna get this, but I just think it's so cute. It's a vintage, like, eight, 1980s. You can tell that's a vintage tag, but it's like, has a detachable top and bottom. It's a romper. I don't like the color, but I think it's just so cute. And look at the back. Wow. But yeah, not my vibe, but I 
do appreciate it. Check out these capris. Very Y2K. I think my favorite sections are the lingerie and the skirts. I love the skirts. Oh, and I love the new racks that they put out before they actually sort everything. Yes, sir. This is cute. It has like baby pink lace and then a polka dotted blue skirt. Some things I just like showing you guys, but I won't get it. Like it's cute, but you know. And this, like, I feel like I'm always finding super cute bustiers, but of course they're never my size. It has like a little flower on it. And then the dresses. Oof, I got a long ways to go. Look at this dress. It seems like it's from the early 2000s by Express. It has this eyelet fabric and then this button down front and then the sleeves. They flare and they have this little point in the bottom. So many cute little details. And I mean, especially just like the cut of it is so unique. It's very like prairie farm coquette vibes. The shape of these are so sick. They make me look a little sad. This always feels like an I Spy book cover, but I'm looking at this watch right here. It says, not nice, and it has a cat. The stove was shaped. Oh, my cart is literally running away. This is probably the least amount of shoes that I've seen here. I came on the wrong day, guys, but you know what? You can't always call it. These are so cute. Come on. I wish I could buy all of them. Look at that monkey. Oh my God, guys. Do you remember these bitches? Oh Lordy. I was triggered when I saw her. Oh my God, wait. Look at that scalp. I want to slap it. I love looking through the Stuffed animals. Oh, oh, ah, uh, never mind. <laughs> no, this looks like somebody I know. Oh, yeah, my brother. I want to find like a really scary teddy bear, or I want to get a teddy bear and make him scary. Oh, look at this guy. Very, very 90s. It's retractable. Ooh, <gasps> look at how, oh, this is beautiful. I would spray it a different color and add to it maybe, I don't know, but it could be a fun little project. Oh, I found these are so sick. These moto gloves, like, come on. <laughs> um, I really like my other gray dress that I have, um, and I was like, maybe this could be like my extra one. <laughs> this thrift trip was below mid. I give it like a four out of ten. I did get some things, but it. The whole place was very dry, like, I just wasn't hitting it, especially the shoe aisle. I mean, that's a tell tale. That's a tell all. I'm gonna show you guys a couple extra things that I thrifted actually yesterday to make up for it. But what I got today is this just super plain Fruit of the Loom oversized shirt. If I'm not going thrifting and wearing a super tight outfit, any other situation i'm just wearing a super baggy outfit and i have a thing for just like a faded blue or just blues in general and also that it's oversized i'm like i know i'm gonna wear this this is an everyday outfit for me with my like sweat wide leg pants okay i got this 
uh, scarf. It was four bucks. But I got it because the material just looks so nice. It's like, looks furry. I like that it just has this texture to it. And I realized that it has this embroidery. That's a quick fix. I'm taking that off. I don't want that. Wait, do you think this is made out of alpaca hair or something? It doesn't say the materials that it's made out of, so maybe this is alpaca. I got these little like hot shorts. They were in the lingerie section. They kind of reminded me of Miu Miu. You know, they have this trend going on where a lot of people are just wearing underwear with tights. And I mean, this has been going on for a long while, but I got them because I really like this color. You can't really tell, but it's like a, gr it's, it's like a grayish blue. And I don't really know how I'll wear them, if I'll style them like for a full outfit or maybe I'll just wear them as pajamas. I got these camo pant, uh, car capris. Yeah. I feel like I just got these for the haul, honestly. I don't think I really wear them. Every time I've gotten camo shit, I pretty much always get rid of it because I'm like, eh, I don't really like it on me. So, I don't know. I don't know. It's very Y2K. And I can tighten the bottoms up. Maybe I can even bring them higher. They're okay. I love this shirt though. See, I know a lot of people want to say I dress like super basic now, but I don't think that's it. I just like to dress simple. I love simplicity in so many aspects of my life, including my closet. I got some socks. I mean, I just love looking at the socks. These ones are 40 cents. These were 75 cents. And these were a dollar. I got this little dress from the lingerie i just love like how fitted it is and it's mini and it feels like a cocktail dress i guess but the fact that it's vintage and it has all these little dainty cute lace details i feel like it's just a cool combination but i think this would be like a cute summer dress i got this just blue fabric and I might use it for some sewing projects maybe my pillow and then this I got it's a bed skirt but also the material is like this kind of like linen I guess you see like all the lines in it and it just I don't know it looks very like it feels like a raw fabric you know I don't like the synthetic fabrics that are like nylon or polyester like this feels like cotton and i was thinking i could use like the edging you see all this like ruffling i could take this off and turn it into the outsides of my pillow and also the fact that it's like this light creamy color i can dye it any color very very easily i'll probably take you guys along with me as i make this pillow but yesterday i went thrifting and i'm going to show you two things that i got that i'm really excited about let me change back to my other outfit though one of the things i got is a super cute like vintage uh i don't really know what it's supposed to be for exactly but i i saw that it was in a set with a tea thing and i kind of wish that i got it i don't think i would use it's like the same material but i don't think i would use it actually for tea but i thought it would be really cute to use as like a vase because it was very tall and it matched this so well but i was like oh, i'll just get this one for now so i know it was like used for some tea thing maybe you put the sugar in here i don't know but i thought it was just like such a cute decoration and it has both handles on each side. I also got this freaking towel. It is a 2003 Incredible Hulk. It's got the brick logo. And it's in such good condition. Look at this. I was telling my friend if I had it like folded on a, a towel rack, I would have this side faced forward. 
thank you guys so much for watching i hope you enjoyed this come thrifting with me we'll do some outfit stuff soon and thank you to parade for sponsoring this video make sure you click my link in the description box and use my code alivera bf and i love you guys i'll talk to you soon